Hey guys, what's up? Okay, so uh, this video is uh, all about uh, giving a small update on uh, what is happening around uh, Bitcoin. Uh, so you must have seen me in couple of last last couple of videos that I've been talking uh, highly about uh, this new invention, this new technology. But uh, you know, so whoever I share this idea of Bitcoin, they still wonder and they still uh, think whether it's even worth you know uh, giving your attention and focus to bitcoin uh, i mean you know and uh, is it something that we should really study or should research uh, on so uh, i want to give you a quick update on as to what is happening uh, around bitcoin community so yesterday i had uh, i attended a seminar which was uh, in mumbai for which was conducted by Bombay uh, Chamber of Commerce, which was on this technology called Open Network, right? Now, Open Network invent Inventions. Now, we all know that the Bitcoin is based out on blockchain, uh, blockchain being the latest and the most significant invention ever uh, after internet, right? So, now, Bitcoin that I keep talking about it all the time is based on blockchain, correct? And blockchain is nothing but it's a distributed ledger, right? Uh, I'm sure it, this this the scope it is not possible for me to cover up uh, the you know blockchain topic right now and to give you the technical of it. But if you Google uh, what is blockchain, uh, you would uh, know what exactly it is. But uh, what I'm trying to update you here now is that uh, the people who are really believing in Bitcoin and they have uh, very high uh, investments into it and they are uh, looking to uh, have a lot of startups within blockchain technology, right? So I would uh, talk about some of the venture capitalists because those are the guys who really uh, fund a lot of startups around the world. And uh, you know, I mean, all the ideas. I mean, whoever comes comes up with an idea and want to start their own company or business, they venture capitalist is where they approach first in order to be funded, correct? And so, uh, if you Google uh, some of the venture capitalists that I know of, which are very famous across the world, uh, one of them would is Tim Draper. I mean, he has funded companies like uh, Tesla Motors you know and uh, many others correct uh, so i mean uh, who would be the better person to uh, talk on to talk on bitcoin uh, other than him now tim draper has very high investments in bitcoin and uh, he has spoken on bitcoin on cnn channel and he just keeps talking about it so tim draper somebody like tim draper is investing into bitcoin there is something really really serious about it that's one venture capitalist. Now, other venture capitalist that I know of is Chamath. Uh, I don't know it's very difficult to pronounce his name, but he's a Sri Lankan guy. Again, he's a he operates from Silicon Valley, and he has a very very huge investment in Bitcoin. So uh, again, uh, if you know the Facebook fame brothers, Winkle Winkle Voss brothers, uh, we all know that, of course, the founder of Facebook was is Mark Zuckerberg, but there was some controversy uh, saying that uh, the idea was stolen by these two brothers. So, I mean, obviously, they had uh, they lost Facebook, but then they have a very high investment in uh, Bitcoin again. You know, so these are the three guys that I'm mentioning now. Now, if you look at my old videos, I've already spoken about people like Bill Gates, uh, Richard Branson. Uh, Ratan Tata, uh, Indian capitalist Ratan Tata investing into Bitcoin technology is a huge, huge thing, correct? And these are not small names. These are probably billionaires and millionaires across the world. So if they have high uh, belief in a system like, you know, invention like Bitcoin, then and huge investments, then I'm sure there is something that we all uh, should uh, at least study. And uh, if we can benefit from it, Nothing like it. Because like I said, this is the next future. This is the next big thing. I mean, um, you know, what was internet in 1994, 1996 or 2000? And what is internet today, right? 
So it's a, it's the same thing. I mean, the, I don't think it would take more than two or three years for Bitcoin to go mainstream. Uh, already, we have a lot of transactions happening uh, with Bitcoin, and uh, people who have uh, taken it from the investment point of view, they have really got a huge profit. And uh, it is just the beginning. Today, uh, it is being traded at the price of eighty six thousand rupees, one Bitcoin. Just just imagine. And then one Bitcoin. So this is how I look at it. One Bitcoin is eighty-six thousand bit. Now you may ask, eighty-six thousand rupees. What can I buy? What if I want to buy a coffee? I'm not going to pay him one Bitcoin. So let me tell you that if you know already, one Bitcoin has about uh, one million bits. So the way I look at it, probably one bit is going to be uh, as uh, equal to uh, probably will be equal to one rupee. Even if one bit is equal to one ruby, one bitcoin is gonna be equal to ten lakh Indian rupees, and that's a huge, huge money, right? And it's only being traded at eighty-seven thousand compared to last year, which which was traded at uh, around thirty thousand rupees one bitcoin. So see, it's going rapidly, and uh, it's it's growing rapidly, guys. So if you have not invested anything, if you have not studied Bitcoin, my request to you is go study it. My only uh, intention of making these videos is to uh, f so that you ca you guys can benefit from hey, from it, and you don't you you don't miss out on this massive opportunity, once in a lifetime opportunity that we all get in our life, correct? So uh, that's it in this video, guys. I hope you got value out of this. Um, Please subscribe to my channel because I'm uh, I'm going to up upload a lot of videos based on this technology based around this Bitcoin so that you guys are updated and can get the maximum benefit out of it. Hope to see you guys soon. Thank you so much for me for listening. Thank you so much. Bye.